ladies and gentlemen, you know what it's time for. Another room tour. We love the room tours. And we are here at Disney's Grand California. Oh my gosh, the Grand. I love, I seriously, it's like my favorite hotel on all of Disney properties so far that I've been to. But anyway, I'm gonna take a little tour with you around the room before, um, you know, we annihilate it. Anyway, let's get to it, shall we? Now as you walk right in, you see that we have a straight view out there to some amazing stuff, but we'll get to that in a second. We're on the fifth floor, just so you guys know. There's an adjoining room over here, but uh, we're just gonna not go pull on that, that'd be mean. But anyway, you walk in here, you notice all this lovely, that craftsman style, arts and crafts style. California. Oh my gosh, so gorgeous. Like, look at this. This is so amazing. And what do we have behind door number one? Lovely closet space. Oh my goodness. You could lay down in there comfortably. And there's a vacuum too. And a cut. Oh, look at this. I do a little laundry, extra pillow and blanket. Maybe I'll be back here. Who the heck knows? I just, I absolutely love like the dark wood and everything. Just the style of this. Really nice. As you can see here, lots of cabinet space. A little step up. Little uh, hidden Mickey kind of half there if you need it. Pretty good. Pretty. Oh, there we go. I I don't want to break anything here. Okay, that's that's just for show. That's just for show. But then over here we've got the bathroom. Yeah, nice, just kind of easy going bathroom. But does come with magical sliding door. Boop. Isn't that wonderful? I love it. And there's a mirror with me. Okay. Come over here to our little breakfast nook area, as it were, kind of, sort of, like a kitchenette, I should say, it's probably a better way to put it. Little refrigerator, some more space here for storing things, also a microwave. The nice television. And chest of drawers, if you want to uh, put your clothes over there. But, if you want instead, you can actually put stuff under the bed. Oh, I didn't mean to make that rhyme. But I do it all the time. Okay, I'm so sorry. Anyway, uh, and then you have the pull-out couch, which will probably be for this guy. And then over here, you've got the chairs and the little table and stuff and another mirror. Lots of mirrors. Nothing wrong with that. Uh, another thing I want to look at, too, little USBs in the clocks. Now, this is a... I believe this is like a deluxe. I don't know if they call them... I think it's deluxe here. I'm not sure. I forget what their nomenclature is, but... Uh, some really um, pretty artwork on the walls, too. I really enjoy it. I think it's so cool. Uh, but yeah, this is the nicest hotel uh, on Disneyland property at the time of this recording. You never know. Maybe in years to come, they'll change that up. But look at this view, ladies and gentlemen. Oh my goodness. I can't... I can't open it. I can't... It's... Oh, there we go. We're opening it. And we just have to step out here for just a second. Oh my gosh. Are you kidding? This is incredible. It's like Goofy Sky Schools right there. Like, oh my gosh, look at, look, I can almost touch it. I can almost, I can almost touch it. That is Paradise, or Pixar Pier. I want to call it Paradise Pier. Wow, this is crazy. That's Cars Land right over there. And that's my mom, right Hi. there. <laughs> Not every room comes with her. That's okay. <laughs> but yeah, I think, we don't, know, we don't know. But I think what we'll probably try to do is maybe show you guys what this looks like at night later on uh, because this will probably be lit up and it'll be gorgeous and at the time of this recording they're not doing world of color because of course they're not but if they were we could sit right here and it would happen right there Ugh, so cool uh, another cool thing that you guys might appreciate is the fact that a lot of those buildings in the background that's not Disneyland that's the Anaheim Convention Center over there that just shows you how good Disney is with sight lines like when you're actually down in the park you can't see any of this stuff which is a testament to uh, the Imagineers and everybody working on this and the engineers and everything. Oh, but this is so cool. What do you think of it? I'm speechless. It is so amazing. It's yeah. Fun. And there's something up there I think we can go to. Oh yeah. Over here, there's kind of like a terrace area. And then we were also told that if you wanted to go watch the fireworks from Paradise Pier, you could do that for Disneyland's fireworks. But we couldn't see that. Unfortunately, that would be like over there somewhere. But that's okay. I think that's a... Uh, Something we can live without. We'll just go see it in the parks. Yeah, a little bit of music and stuff. Oh, it's so cool. This is amazing. And here is a shot of that same view at night. So cool. Now, uh, Disney's California Adventure is closed for the evening, so this would be much more kinetic, or it was, you know, about an hour or two ago. But still, so pretty. So cool to see how this park, in particular, at least uh, from my point of view, has really uh, come into its own over the years. You know, it kind of started um, not in the best way, 
but it always had that potential and there's some aspects of it that I thought were just fantastic but I see cars land over there it's so cool uh, but yeah it just it's lovely it's so so cool and I'm so thankful not only that I get to stay here and that uh, Auntie Linda as I'm supposed to call her helped us get this room but uh, that I'll get to be here with my mom it's really really cool yeah mm -hmm. I hope you guys enjoyed this room tour video if you did just let me know in the comments I want to see more stuff like this in the future. Yeah. Oh my gosh. You like it? It's so beautiful. So pretty. You could just sit out here. And in the morning, I'm sure it will be gorgeous too. Yeah. If I remember to do it, maybe I'll try to throw that in as well. <laughs> but like I said, let us, let us know if you enjoyed it. That'd be great. I nearly forgot to do the most important thing in a room tour. And that's the bed test. All right, here it is. You better do mine. Yep, um, yep, that's the one I'm doing already. Uh, oh my gosh. It's like sleeping on a cloud, I'd imagine. <laughs> it's so comfortable. Okay, that's the bed that Ma gets. Now we get to try out the bed I'm going to use. Okay, here we go. <laughs> here we go. Okay. okay. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> You know, it's not that bad. Uh, I thought I was gonna hurt myself badly there. <laughs> Call the crash cart. It's not gonna matter in like an hour because I'll be unconscious. But every time I do this, I keep thinking I hold the camera right above my head. And if I were to drop it, I'd be a real fool. Anyway, that's gonna do it for us tonight. But I'm gonna show you guys a morning view as well because I think that'll be pretty sweet. So, good night. And good morning from Disney's Grand Californian. And look at this. We're looking over Pixar Pier in the morning now. And look at that, the Incredicoaster going. My mom was saying that they've run it about 10 or 12 times. Maybe this is number 13, my favorite number. It's going today because yesterday it was not going at all. But there it goes. Boom. It's such a fun ride, and especially for an overlay, like for me, I don't know, I just really love The Incredibles. Uh, <laughs> so it makes this ride really cool for me. So yeah, well, I hope you guys enjoyed the full room tour now, uh, but uh, if you want to uh, support the video, just uh, let us know, or let me know in the comments what you thought of it. I hope you, you enjoyed it, and you know, if you wanna do more stuff like this in the future, uh, let me know. But yes, thank you guys so much for hanging out here with me today. I really appreciate it. See, now I can prove that I'm here, that this isn't just footage, and I just woke up a while ago. <laughs> and until next time, just remember to adapt and overcome. Bye-bye.